And that's where we begin our Disney story, with the first original Mickey Mouse. Walt is desperately trying to come up with a new cartoon character. Here's Walt's own story of how it happened. I was in New York at the time. I'd been producing a series of pictures for a company there that were about a rabbit called Oswald. But I lost that. They took it away from me, so I was all alone and had nothing. And Mrs. Disney and I were coming back from New York on the train, and I had to have something. I said, by the time we get to Hollywood, I must have something to... Uh, I can't tell them I've lost Oswald. So I, I had this mouse in the back of my head, because a mouse is a sort of a sympathetic character, in spite of the fact that everybody's frightened of a mouse, including myself. So Mickey Mouse was born, but he was not an overnight success. The whole world applauded when Mickey finally decided to say a few well-chosen words. Oh, I can't play. Play! Yes, ma'am. Mickey Mouse had now arrived. His great moment came in 1932, when all of Hollywood turned out to present Mickey with his first Academy Award. Here's Mickey and Minnie now. Followed by Pluto. That garage where Mickey got his big break into show business is a long way from the Disney studio of today. I only hope that we never lose sight of one thing, that it was all started by a mouse. 